These saltwater aquarium plants grow fast and can take over your tank. Once you discover it, the best thing to do is remove it and keep it under control. It can damage other plant species. You can usually remove it by hand. When you do, try not to break the bubbles as this might cause it to spread. You can try to introduce certain types of fish like the Soo Tang or Red Sea Indian Ocean Sailfin Tang, Acanthurus Soo, to eat bubble algae. The best means of control, however, seems to be the emerald crab. These crabs won't damage your corals, but will eat the bubble algae. It is a good idea to learn about other such interactions between saltwater aquarium plants and herbivores as they might save you time and trouble in the future. The emerald crabs are a great idea for the reef aquarium, where they won't fight with other inhabitants. There are even coral farmers who use emerald crabs to control algae around their hard corals. So you can protect your saltwater aquarium plants by stocking some of these little helpers. So what's your next step? Now that you know a little bit about the good and the bad kinds of saltwater aquarium plants, it's your job to make sure you learn more. Your local aquarist will be able to tell you more about which saltwater aquarium plants are most suitable for your tank, level of expertise and the other species you want to stock.